What's good people, it's your boy and today I'm gonna be making some fire drill beats for uh, someone like RD or Dion Vane or someone like that. I already kinda started the recording and then it crashed but I made this simple melody over here with the piano from Keyscape and I'm using this dark, or, uh, dark score preset inside of Keyscape so there's just some simple chords in A minor scale so let's break down what we have here. So first chord we have is an E minor. Second chord that we have is D minor, but just, I just moved this uh, D uh, one octave up. So, uh, third chord is an, another E minor, and the fourth chord is C minor. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's just copy that over and added some top melodies over this. Let's play this for you guys. And by the way, I also have half time on this, which is just this half loop preset. And this is how the melody sounds. So that is pretty much it for the piano, now let's add some EQ on this and just uh, cut out this low frequency. Now let's also try and add some secret sauce and I, I've been using this drop preset a lot recently. Now let's open up another instance of Omnisphere and add some pads behind this. So just layer with this chords already. So we have this uh, pad from Bilob's Omnisphere um, Bank Volume 1 and it's this pad number 3 and I just set it to the same mixer track as the piano and I just moved it down a few octaves so this is how it sounds with the piano. So just add some more ambience behind this. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the piano and the chords and the pad. Now I'm going to add some strings or some flutes or something like that. So I'm going to use Omnisphere for that as well. Okay, so we settled down with these, uh, with this Spitfire solo violin uh, library instead of contact and all I did, I just turned off this expression uh, knob to around 75% and this is the panel that we have going on here, this is how it sounds. So I just made this uh, note longer here. And that's pretty much it. Let's add this to the mixer track and let's add some effects. First, let's see out some of the low frequencies. And let's throw in some reverb. And now let's try uh, pitching this sample down a few semitones, maybe two. Okay, so G minor sounds insane. Let's uh, set the scale to the G minor. That's pretty much it for the melodies for now. Let's uh, start with these drums.
let's add some rolls uh, in the beginning here. And here as well. Let's copy the sore. Now let's make this go up in velocity. Now let's set this to the third beat and just make this triplet over here. Now let's add some lower notes below this. here now let's start with these iterates Yeah, that sounds pretty nice. Sir, let's add a kick. Copy all of these sounds over and let's add a open hat. Uh, 
Uh, let's copy this sore as well. That's pretty much it now. I wanna add, uh, I wanna try and add a ground base to this because I feel like it will fit this, but we'll see. Okay, so fuck ground base. There is no space in this for ground base, but uh, we need to add a counter melody. So I'm going to open up yet another instance of Omnisphere and add some counter melodies with the piano. Maybe even change the preset in here. Now let's add this to the mixer and add a bunch of effects. So first off, let's open up a uh, secret sauce and add this drop, drop effect. And throw in some echo boy as well. Yeah, but anyways, that is pretty much it for this beat. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, let me know what you think about this beat. I'm gonna let you guys just the final beat of this. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Oh, 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 oh,